This week in Met Youth, we continued on with our series, Best Seller, where we've been talking about the Bible. You got it. And you may be thinking, Matt, don't we always talk about the Bible in Met Youth? Yes, you're right. You're right. But normally we talk about the contents of the Bible, right? The, the characters that are described in here and, and the miracles and parables of Jesus and talk about the promises that are told to us for our future. But how often do we, do we really look at what the Bible is, or maybe even more importantly, why the Bible is? Why does it exist, and what role does it play in our lives? Unfortunately, all too often, we see the Bible as just another book on the shelf. And we come up with all these different reasons and excuses for why we shouldn't actually pick it up and read it, right? The, the print is too small. Uh, it's too old. It's too outdated. It's too long. I don't know where to start. And the list goes on and on and on. Others of us see the Bible as a manual or an instruction booklet, right, that we only pull out when we really, really need it. But is that all the Bible's good for? Just quick fixes and spiritual patch jobs? There's a verse in Psalm 119 that really makes it clear for us what the purpose of Scripture is in our lives. And that verse is Psalms 119, 105, which talks about how God's Word is a lamp to our feet and it's a light to our path. We have all walked around in darkness before. Maybe, maybe for you that's been at, at your house at night with all the lights off. Or maybe it's camping in the woods. Maybe you've done that before. It can be a little scary, a little intimidating when there's just darkness around you and you can't see your path. And what the psalmist is saying is that God's word is literally a lamp to your feet. It's a light to your path. It shows you where to go and it helps you navigate your world. It's not meant to just be a one-time read when, when life is tough and then put back on the shelf. No, it's meant to literally navigate your world. Before you head into life groups to discuss this a little further, I just want to remind you of a couple of things. The Bible is God's Word. It's 100% true and accurate, and I want you to know that. And also, it is a light to your path, but it's not meant to be kept alone. You're not supposed to keep this light for yourself. It's meant to be taken out. It's meant to be shared with people that you cross paths with. And as you cross paths with people, people are going to notice that your walk, your path is a little bit different than theirs, that you're not stumbling over things that, that they are. And, and they're going to ask you, what is so different about your path? What is this light that you're following? And an opportunity will be presented to you to share what that light is and who the Jesus is that you follow. And that's something worth talking about. 